is scheduled for one full with a 15 minute time limit. Tonight is Lacey. Two in a row. Man, these guys are huge. These are not small men. Very intimidating. I feel sorry for their uh, competition in this match. Al Falcone and Shadow Ninja. They've got quite the battle to contend with. So this one is definitely agility and technical prowess over brute strength, aggression and brawn. And of course we see how uh, deceptive Lacey Madison can be outside on the ring as well. So she's a very big advantage to the Murdochs in this one. Their opponents... Both of these men make up one of the Murdochs, weight and size. I think you're right. And uh, as I say, the Murdochs definitely have that uh, size, strength and power advantage, but uh, we have seen amazing things from Shadow Ninja and Al Falcone in the past. Al Falcone has had a couple of run-ins with uh, Southern Wrecking Crew in a couple of shows. Right. Going to want to try and get some sort of redemption. It'd be hard pressed to find anyone who just loved getting in the ring and putting on a show more than these guys when it comes to New Zealand wrestling. They absolutely live for it. I believe these guys have actually got a really interesting name as well. Fanta. Fanta? What does that mean? Falcons and ninjas are totally awesome. I don't know if that's true, but it makes sense. Hey, well, if it's written on my sheet here, it must be true. Well, this match is kicking off straight away. Getting straight oh. into it. Murdoch's going to the outside, just getting a bit of a breather. What Shadow Ninja got? Oh, oh drop kick. Just kicks the, one of the Murdochs for good measure. And to be fair, it's going to take tactics like that to actually. Uh, we got Al Falcone needs to win this for match. something. There he goes, he's going over the top. Oh, oh huge. Big tope. Going over the top row, right into both the Murdochs there. Crowd loving it. That's what it's going to take. They have to use, they have to capitalise on their speed and agility. Definitely. Oh. And right there. I think that was just a one count. Right there, a one count, and he just got lifted off the ground completely. Shadow Ninja getting the crowd behind him. Levi Murdoch. Look at that, as I say. It's uh, going to take more more strategy than that to take these men down. Yeah, that was kind of like running into a brick wall. That's exactly what it looked like. Uh, <laughs> you couldn't have said any better, Andrew. Maybe a southern brick wall. A southern brick wall. They're pretty good at wrecking them usually, but yeah. The ref really needs to get control of this match. He's quite intimidated, but then who can blame him, to be honest? Yeah, the size of these men, they're huge. I wouldn't want to be. I wouldn't want to be in his shoes either. And quite, quite the big job ahead of him. Yeah, Stan Murdoch capitalising on uh, the wrist distraction. Falcon not liking it at all. Oh, 
Oh, clean off shot. Top right. Back into the middle there, Rowan. Levi taking uh, exception to Al Falcone on the side there. Thinks he's encroaching too much into the ring space. Lacey Madison looks like she's slowly making her way around to Al Falcone's side. He might want to keep his wits about him. Definitely have to keep an eye on her. Big punch to the top of the head of Shadow Ninja. And he's never going to be able to get up. Just that, you know, that weight advantage that the Levi Murdoch has. Getting into the face of the ref. That's the style of the Southern Wrecking Crew. Psychology, brute strength, aggression. And utter, utter ruthlessness. That's how they've made their name. That's why they have been quite successful here at Aftershock. Absolutely. Absolute force here in New Zealand wrestling. Their time will come, though. Someone will stand up to them. Someone has to. Well, many have tried. They all seem to be failing, though. That is true. And Falcon just absolutely reaching and stretching for that tag. Just hasn't got the reach. On. Oh, Falcon trying it on. I agree with Stan Murdoch there. That was interference from Al Falcone there. What do you think? Well, technically... I mean, yeah, sure, he's trying to help his buddy out, but... Uh, well, he does have hold, hold of those uh, ring ropes, those tag ropes, which uh, you have to be hold, holding on to when tagged. Shadow Ninja just getting thrown around the ring like a, like a rag doll. It's the only way to put it. And Al Falcone on the side of the ring just trying to get the crowd behind Shadow Ninja. Oh, it just fires it back into the corner. The slower this match is, the more advantage the Southern Wrecking Crew do, do have. Yeah, well, I mean, Ninja just needs to be uh, trying to get that tag from Al Falcone any chance he can. But they, Al, they, they have cut off the side of the room. They're, they're like, great, any, great teamwork. Great like any teamwork. good tag team should. You'll see everything they do is on their side of the room. Levi having no, none of that. Words being exchanged between Al Falcone and Stan Murdoch. Ooh. I'm kind of looking forward to those two going toe to toe in a minute, hopefully. It's not going to happen soon at this rate, though, because the Murdochs have got things well and truly oh, under looks, control. Looks like they've got a double team planned here. Oh, big double kick to the midsection. And just absolute disdain for the referee. They're going to have to be careful. They could get disqualified here. As the referee will be well aware, sometimes that's the worst thing you can do to these fellas. Yes, that is true. We've seen that uh, go down pretty badly. Absolute disrespect there from uh, Stan Murdoch. I'm not too sure if he needed to tell us that we are actually watching the match. Although, I, don't, I, don't, I, I hope he didn't hear me say that. <laughs> Getting right up in the face of Al Falcon. Oh. To be fair, I think, you know, I think he's just trying to highlight the fact that we are live, we're here, you know. That's a good we're, point. We're calling it live and, you know, he, he's just trying to do the best for the product. That He's is, got a good business brain on him to stand Murdoch. That's true. That, 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 that is some good bias logic from you there, John. It's not bias, it's just truth. Oh, oh is this the moment it's going to change? Ninja getting out of the way of that big splash. This could be, this oh, could Rosa be the gets of the, the hot tag. Here comes our folk Oh, oh a kick to the head. Oh, drop kick. Oh, look comes at back it. up. And this is, this is what it could oh, take. Oh, big forearm. His athleticism from Falcone. Not too sure if he saw the tag, though. 
Needs to look behind him. Oh, no. Oh, and down he goes. Big boot to the face. And Murdoch's back in, con- back in control. One would say one big shot to the beak, even. Yeah, absolutely. It's over. It is over. An absolute decimation. Of Al Falcone and the Shadow Ninja. The Murdochs! At the hands of Levi and Stan Murdoch. Just a big demolition. No other way to describe it. No other way to describe it. They always had the advantage. And there are your winners, the Southern Wrecking Crew, the Murdochs, with Lacey Madison. And now it's time to hear from one of our other competitors in tonight's 30-man stampede match, Rough Guts, Roddy Gunn.